Hello! Today I want to talk to you about cartooning and making cartoons. So the first thing you need to remember is that cartoons are not real. They're not real. They are based on real life, but they are exaggerated or overemphasized. And so we're going to do some different cartoons. And I would like for you as your assignment to create 30 different cartoons. Now these can be faces, these can be objects, these can be personified um, elements, animals that are personified or uh, food that is personified, all sorts of things. And so one thing that I like to do is start, if you were in my class right now, I would give you some starter shapes. So if you wanna freeze the video at this point and sketch out some starter shapes, you can copy these if you want to, or you can make your own. That's totally up to you, but try to make them unusual. That way you can think about them differently than you would if you were just drawing circles and ovals, which some circles and ovals are okay. So I'm gonna take one of these papers. You can also do this, if you run out of ideas, you can also do this with letters. So let's see, just as an idea, what do I wanna do? Look at it, and as I do these, I kind of think of stories in my head of things that are happening. So this is gonna be a bird. It's a very strange bird. It can have more than two eyes if I really, you know what I do, I want it to have more than two eyes. I want it to have three eyes. And I want this to be kind of spiky feather type things coming out of its head. So maybe it's not a bird, maybe it's a, Heffalump, I don't know. You can add feet onto it if you want to. Because it's a cartoon, remember? It's imaginary, it's made up. So that's one idea. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna skip around some here. This one, I told you it could be objects of different things. So, I'm gonna make this one so it's a Tootsie Pop. So it's like that. And then I can color these and make them more interesting if I want to. You know, like so. And let me see. As I look at these, some of these are more interesting than others, in my mind at least. So this is gonna be a scuba mask. Do you scuba? Do you scuba? This is me scuba diving because I'm claustrophobic and I don't really do that. So you'd have to put hair up here, okay? So just think about some different shapes. And then on this one, it says draw five of your own on the back. So if you are copying my paper, perfectly fine. Uh, and then you're gonna do five of your own on the back. And so remember these shapes can be whatever you need them to be. And so if I wanna make Say I want to make a cylinder because I want to make the toilet paper that's running away from everyone because it's afraid. I'm going to have sweat coming off of him because he's running. He's running away. No! That's what he would be saying. So in my mind, like I said, all of these have different uh, ideas going on. If you're gonna if you're gonna do so on the back too, I wouldn't use marker per se. Uh, you don't have to color them, but sometimes that adds a new dimension to what you're making. So you're gonna do five original, and they can be kind of interesting shapes. You can even start with a really small shape and then build out from that to make it more interesting if you want to. And I know you think you know where you're going with me, but you don't know. You don't know where I'm going. It's a little girl with great big ears and a tiny little nose and a very small mouth. So have some fun cartooning. Remember, you have all week to do this. You're not supposed to spend more than 15 to 30 minutes. If it takes you longer and you're enjoying it, by all means, knock yourself out. Um, the next project that we're gonna do 
is going to be to cartoonify a person. So that person can be you, it can be a member of your family, it can be a teacher, which is usually what we do at school. It can be somebody else in your life that you think would be worth cartooning. Maybe you want to cartoonify the president or the governor or anybody else that we've seen in the media. So be thinking about as you're making these cartoons, what kind of cartoon you want to do next week, which is going to be our final project, which makes me a little bit sad. So until we talk again, have a fabulous day.